Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, this game. Okay. Okay, this game. <laughs> this game is broken. And today, I wanted to see what this season 9 nonsense is all about. It's probably not nonsense. Probably really cool. I'm actually really hopeful for this. Kind of fallen off Fortnite in the past season. Uh, let me know in the comment section if you are the same. But today in this video, I just want to check out the battle pass, check out the map, and just take a look at what's different. So if you enjoyed this video, drop it a thumbs up, drop a subscribe, and uh, yeah, should be good. So this, apparently, what I've heard is we are in the future. Oh, no, no, no. Oh my, this is cool. I love the banana skin, by the way. <laughs> Aspirational electro music. Do, 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 do. Yes, I love this. Oh no. <laughs> Ooh. Some freaking like Gundam. Cu oh my god, he's drinking the banana. <laughs> oh, he's happy about it. I don't know why. Oh, yeah, it's like some freaking Gundam anime stuff. That's so cool. Loving the beard as well. It's actually quite. Ooh! Joy of Instant Anthem! Oh, dude! The future is yours! Awesome! That's pretty cool. Me likey, me likey so far. Oh, the background's pretty cool. Oh, I've got some XP to collect. Battle pass. Here it is. Hang on. Let me. Where, where were we before? So yeah, we got the tilted towers thing. We'll check that out in a little minute. Um, wow, this is kind of cool. I like this. Very nice. Very nice indeed. What are the game modes? We've got solos, duos, squads, team rumble, creative playground, arena, arena. Trios, Battle Pass, Season 9. Can you believe it? Ends in 75 days. Oh, here he is, Sentinel. Wow, that's so good. I'm not going to lie, though. <laughs> he's a chicken, right? <laughs> he's a robot chicken. Like, he's got the beak, he's got the little red mohawk thing. And look at his feet. Dead giveaway. The, the chicken feet. Am I the only one that's realized that he's a chicken? This is kind of cool. Uh, there is a double axe kind of thing. Is this a backpack? Two strikes. Harvesting tool. No, it's literally two axes. We're going to get that, obviously, and check that out. Nice. Right, let's just buy the battle pass and um, go through everything together. I love that. Okay, let's just... <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, look how cool this looks. Oh, I'm a huge fan. What is this? Sentinel Dark? And then... Cool. Awesome. Right, so... Oh! Interesting. So I've just realized that is the first skin you get, but obviously the dark version. Interesting. Okay. So here we go. Sentinel... This is one. Pretty cool. We've got some more XP. Uh, personal XP boost as well. Rock love. Oh, that's awesome. So that's this is free. If you don't if you don't play Fortnite, top row is free. So if you don't pay for the game, these are the free unlocks. If you do pay for it, these are the ones you get. So we've got that. 100 V-Bucks. I'm not going to look at every single thing here. Oh, that's cool. Sentinel kind of skin. Nice. Little neon glow thing. That's cool. We've got the axe as well. Nice. Rocks. Uh, let's see if anything interests here. Ooh. Get a turbo spin. Drifting spray. Oh, it's the banana skin. <laughs> That's great. Little field flyer. That is deliberately boring. Uh, I feel bad about saying that. Like, someone had to design that. I'm like, that is deliberately boring. I mean, it's free, so it was not meant to be awesome, right? And here we have the default skin from the cave. That is actually a really good skin. 
And it's the first, I think it's the first skin we've actually got like a keep, a cape-like animation on the front. It'll be interesting to see how that, vibrant, nice. Got a little, oh, it's a little pet cat thing. Nice. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Alright, level 30, we've got like a rock thing, that's cool. More V-Bucks, flying disc, frisbee, is that a Captain America thing? Bunker Basher for free, level 38. A Scarlet Strike. Okay, this is actually not too bad because I kind of like the simplicity of these smaller uh, gliders and the red neon thing is actually pretty cool. So we've got this. Oh, interesting. And oh, this is free. That's amazing. I actually love that. We've got another cat, but in purple. Uh, we've got a really cool skin here, actually. Oh, she changes. Oh, she's going to be a popular skin for sure. I like that color scheme. Wait, Tracer? That actually looked like Tracer, didn't it? I'm not going to lie. Is that flying bananas? Oh my word. <laughs> love it. A microphone here. Nice music. Wow. June! Level 56, we've got pink splatter. That's kind of vibrant and cool. A green little cat pet thing. Nice bush. <laughs> this is, oh, I've seen this before. This is a really neat idea. So it's a Victor Royale card cutout that he obviously throws around and stuff. That's really awesome. Don't know what they'll do if they change that animation again. Because they've, they've changed it once before. Another cool skin here. Stratus. It's kind of purple. He's got a map thing that glows on his arm. That's awesome. Uh, there's no there's no more free things here. So if you get this far, you, you kind of don't get any more stuff. Whoa, lightning strike. That's kind of awesome. Glider here. Retaliator. Oh, that looks cool. I love the futuristic vibe. It's really good. The neon colors and stuff. Oh my god, that's an animated weapon skin and then we've got demi she's got a robot arm interesting <laughs> okay next up uh plasma trail that looks pretty awesome ah. yeah no actually that's kind of catchy no level 95 always has a good dance that that's okay i don't mind that power surge animated so this kind of animates by the look of it doesn't 100 v bucks and then we've got the sentinel dark version this looks really cool and actually with the katana on the back it's actually legit <laughs> nice and then here is uh vendetta wow actually cool skin to start off with there's 11 four out of 11 five out of 11 six seven eight Wow, this dude is actually looking awesome here. What's 11? Oh, cool. This is a good skin. This is an actually good level 100 skin. And I like the progression here. The last tier 100 skin was not interesting. I didn't like it at all. But yeah, awesome. So what am I going to rock? Let's pick the, the setup for me. Let's go with the dark. Oh, she's got skins as well. Oh, look at that. Yeah, he's cool. I like that. Ooh, tough one. This guy looks pretty cool with his... Katana on the back, but I'm gonna go with the Dark Sentinel because, I mean, it's a freaking, it's a robot. Hello, Katana. I'm gonna keep uh, pickaxe. We've definitely got to go ahead and choose the double, wherever that is. That's gonna be really interesting to see if there's like a different animation for it. And then here we'll go for the highest tier, I think, which was this one. It looks pretty cool. I like it. I like it. Got to be honest. I think I preferred the last tier's uh, Booty Boy. I think this was a much nicer glider than the highest level one we've got this time. That's just my opinion. You guys might be different. All right, let's pick a lightning strike, the neon glow. We've got vibrant, the plasma, bananas. I think I'm going to go with the plasma, you know, I think that looks, oh no, vibrant actually. Yeah, vibrant looks cool. I like that. Uh, we're not going to change the dances, but I will change the skin. So, oh my God, this is going to take ages, guys. <laughs> Yeah, that, that storm thing, animated weapon skins, that's kind of cool. So let's see this in action. Ooh, nice. Does it change color or does it just stay like this? Let's go for the storm. I think that's like the best one. Dude, that actually looks legit. I've never seen that before like that. Everyone's favorite weapon in the game right now, the bow and arrow. It is completely overpowered. Don't care what anyone says. I'm going for the banana peel. 
with that one. And I think that's it done. Nice. So let's jump into a game of Playground and just check out the map. That's all I want to do. All right. So here we are. Oof. Frame rate. Hello. Are we good? Are we good, game? Yeah, look. I got two axes. Oh, that's awesome. No, I really like that. I'm really surprised they didn't actually release that for the last season. Maybe that was the intention. Ha! Huh. Hey, that's kind of cool. Right, let's uh, jump in here to a thing. Whoop -a -doop -a -doop. And uh, yeah, dusty divot, I guess. Pleasant Park. Pleasant Park's not even there anymore. Oh, nice. <gasps> oh, was that thing over there? Wow, this is awesome. There's like these weird... Dude, that's actually legit cool. Um, all these tubes and stuff. I just want to check out before we go into Tilted. This little floating airbase. That's actually so cool. And these 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 new um, I think they're called streamlines. I think they're called. But basically, you go in them, and it's a way to get around the map. Kind of an interesting. It's kind of like you know, <laughs> Finding Nemo. Oh, this is. Wow. Cool. I love it. They're adding verticality. Uh, okay. Can you... Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Nice. Yeah, definitely like the new pickaxe thing. That's kind of cool. Let's get, let's get a weapon here. Just, just so we've got something to grab onto. Wait. They've added back in the burst rifle? Or is that just because I'm in playgrounds, probably? Yeah, awesome. Alright, so this is sweet. Nothing's changed about the pirate ship. Oh, God. Oh! Oh! Save myself. Let's see if we can get into one of these air things and go over to... Look at Tilted. It looks awesome. Is that it? Oh, no. That... <laughs> okay. Don't do what I did, kids. That uh, sucks. Are we in now? Yeah, we're in. Okay, so how does this work? So I'm not pressing anything right now, and I'm slowly gliding forwards. If I hold forwards, I go forwards. I don't go down, and then I'm aiming where I want to go. Okay, interesting. <gasps> There's a massive air, air turbine thing up there. Ooh, burger's still there. Still rifts in the game. I love these blimps in the air. That's really cool. Wow, look at Tilted. Like the skylights and stuff. Okay, what is up with this kind of... So this vault thing is still here. I love... <gasps> no! Okay, I'm gutted, guys. Can we, in the chat, RIP Loot Lake Buildings? No! I'm still annoyed they got rid of the house originally that was there. Oh, actually gutted. I mean, don't get me wrong. These look really cool. I'm absolutely devastated that they freaking... There's no way you have to either build up to the air. Interesting. Or there's these little things that kind of... There we go. Kind of... Wow. I really don't know what kind of... How this is going to change the flow of the game with these wind turbines being in the game. Oh, wow. Whoa! Okay. Okay. This is actually way cooler than... I mean, it looked cool. Don't get me wrong, but... Wow, the giant burger. And the statue. <laughs> okay, we need to get a, like, view of this. I can't believe they got rid of Tilted. I'm still a little bit in shock, honestly. I mean, I love the fact there's playgrounds. Like, I, c I get a chance to see where the loot spawns are. Like, you can't build in the... You just have to kind of... Can you, like, 180? Wow, that's huge. You can 180. And you can, like, go, no, nope, want to go this way. That's crazy. That's what that is. I love the giant de burger shop. That is really cool. So you can kind of exit and then pull out your glider. Haha, <laughs> look at that! That's amazing! Yeah, it's kind of hard to get back into it. Like, it's fine now. But like, if you're in a game and someone's shooting at you, it might, might be a little bit challenging. That's crazy. Oh, check this out, guys. Okay. Look! So there's a way, I'm assuming... What the... Okay, that was mean. To get back up to Polar Peaks. Oh, yeah, yeah. Totally possible. Okay. Nope. That's great. Yeah. That's awesome. That's really great. All right. So, where to next? Oh, I know. 
So there's another area that's new on the map. And that is, well it's not new, but it's, it is new. It's called the Mega Mall. And it is a Pleasant Park replacement. I kind of alluded to it earlier. So let's go over there and check that out. We're also kind of scan the rest of the map. It's, yeah, these wind tunnels through the map. So here's the thing. I'm going to go and get the expressway. You can see, like, these turbines actually show on the map. So I'm going to use this one at Fatal Fields to get to the mall. Because you, the reason why this is so huge is it's not like a zip line. Like, these are literally everywhere on the map. And you can easily get to any of them. You know, you build up maybe six, six like, maximum of eight ramps and you're on one you know and then you're away one you're not going to get shot at you can kind of zip out of here it's going to be really annoying to chase people down like they're going to be able to get out of here real quick whoa look at this okay we're nearly here like look how quick i got to freaking mega mall by the way love the name mega mall that's a great name okay so we can just <laughs> man they should invent these in real life i would totally use those uh... okay don't invent them in real life an actual vending machine. Don't get anything out of that, though. That's the problem. Look at this! The Mega Mall! Okay, this is way better than Pleasant Park. Obviously, Pleasant Park has been OG for ages and uh, will be missed. But this is this is kind of awesome. And anything with the word Mega in it is just instantly cool. Grenades are back in the game, by the way. Wait, did that just say Flush Factory? <laughs> it's a toilet! Oh, that's cool. I love it. Flush Factory's back. Junk for cash. Oh, look, there's all the old assets in there. Nice. It's kind of cool. Some loot here. That's. I find it so bizarre. Man, those skins are scary. I want them. I find it so amazing that they completely just... Oh, grapple. Completely just don't care. They'll just delete stuff, you know? <laughs> it's like people would have spent hundreds and hundreds of hours on, like, the designs of some of this stuff. And they just completely just like, yeah, it doesn't matter. It don't matter. Right, the next place I want to check out. This is fantastic, by the way. Is I want to get over there. So the volcano, as you can see, has... I don't know, but we're going to go over there and check it out. It looks like it's hardened over or something. There's still lava coming out of it, but we're going to go over there. Is there a way... Okay, we can kind of do that. Get on the expressway. There we go. Transfer. <laughs> oh, that's... Yeah, I'm a fan. Dusty, please bring back. Dusty Divot and Salty Factory. I, I miss them. Okay, it's important. So, let's have a look. So, this is all the same here. We've got the lava things that work still the same. Okay, you've outdone yourselves here, lads. <laughs> no, I like this. This is... Wow. So, the Aztec kind of area... What was it called? Forgotten now. Sunny Steps is unchanged by the looks of it. All of the pirate ship zone is the same i think doesn't look too changed or too different seeing the volcano like much wider it's kind of awesome i i'm impressed like the battle pass is way better than last season um i actually think the map change is a lot like changes the game a lot more than it did in the than the last season like we had the volcano but i think the last season change looked very different but i don't actually think it changed a lot i don't think it actually changed too much for gameplay i really like this section i hope they don't actually remove the the cove or the lagoon it's called because it looks beautiful it, like it's such a nicely made thing wow you can literally whoa dude that's crazy you see what i just did so i was whoa that's huge for gameplay this is what i'm talking about for gameplay wise I was at the volcano, or pressure plant as it's now called, and I'm going to end up in Tilted without touching the floor, without building. That's huge gameplay change. That's massive. I want to check out these turbines, actually. This kind of dual wield. Kind of a neat idea. I'm just really shocked that this wasn't in the Viking. That would be a perfect release. Maybe it wasn't ready or something. Oh, yeah, weird. There's, like, little zip lines up to them. Okay, it's playground style to keep mining. Oh, there's a baller here as well. There's a lot of wind turbines. I'll be honest, I really thought they were going to get rid of the ballers in this season. Like, they change competitive so much. Like, if you've watched competitive Fortnite, at the end, there's like usually about 30% of the people in the end game are just sat in ballers trying to avoid fights. 
So I really thought they'd get rid of them to change it up a little bit. But I guess not. Okay, so this is the same. I feel like they've definitely increased the range of the baller. Check this out. Hang on, let me just... Alright. Like, I swear I could never make that pull before. Uh, so yeah, there we go. There's a look at Tilted from here. Looks absolutely awesome. Um, again, let me know what you think down in the comment section. I think this is like a great... A great change. Um, the wind turbines weird. Like, I want to know a bit more about them. Like, are they going to turn on at some point? Or... Because they don't really serve much of a purpose. They, they look cool, but they don't serve any gameplay purpose. Um, also, I really want to see if I can get up to one of these uh, little blimps. I don't think I can. Uh, that would require some insane uh, height from my baller here. And uh, yeah, let me just try one more thing. I want to see, can I get into... Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, this game. Okay. Okay, this game. <laughs> this game is broken. Alright. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Take care.